What's up, what's up everybody? So Hyde just came out with a whole bunch of new flavors. I did not get all of them. There's a couple that I passed over for the sake of cost. One of them was called Fire and Ice. Um, they had some other ice flavors I didn't dip into. And then there are some classics here. Um, if you know anything about Hyde, you know that they make around five to six dollar handhelds. Uh, they make this one, they make a stick one that kind of looks like a jewel or a smoke with a Q if you've ever had those. Um, kind of like this right here. Um, these are great as well. As far as a review goes, yeah, these pass the test. These are great. They're also 5 um, or 50 milligrams salt nicotine. Um, they have a battery in them and a small tank that actually isn't a tank full of liquid, but it has some kind of... Um, uh, I like cotton that the juice is like soaked into um, but without further ado let's get on to it here out of all their new flavors I and I don't even like dessert flavors of vapes but um, or juices but this right here tastes like custard it tastes like vanilla rice pudding or some kind of pudding it is amazing how good this is right here um, as you know they have an end uh, that blinks when it's out and it lights up when you're hitting it so oh telling you dog oh, don't get no better than these bad boys right here um, okay next up we're gonna move to the Peach mango watermelon. Okay, right there. This right here tastes like some kind of candy. It tastes like some kind of peach uh, Jolly Rancher. Um, you can kind of taste that watermelon in there if you've had their watermelon ice. I mean, it's sort of kind of not really in there, but you're more so getting that peach. Um, fruity flavor uh, it's got a sweetness in it that all these other hides have as well so if you're used to their strawberry and you really like that strawberry flavor you're gonna love that you're gonna love the honeydew you're gonna love the blue raz the pink lemonade um, a lot of people assume I think that cherry uh, juices they tend to smell and taste like cough syrup not the case with the cherry lemonade Cherry Lemonade will surprise you. Um, but next up is the Honeydew Punch. Honeydew has a little bit of like almost an ice flavor, but not really. If you like their L-Y-C-H-E-E, -E, lychee, lychee, um, this is a little bit close to that, but it has more of like a floral, fragrant taste to it. Very, very unique. And again, you're getting that sweetness, just like you're getting with them other ones, boy. All right, playboys, let's see what we're doing here. And playgirls. Huh. Had to hit that jank a second time, know what I'm saying? All right. And uh, what's next, what's next? Strawberries and cream. Hey, why not? It smells like a gum. It smells like a nerd's, no, not nerd's rope. Um, is it Laffy Taffy? There's that candy that has like that creamy middle, but like a candy outside. And that's what you're getting with the uh, strawberries and cream. Oh, yeah. So if you like desserty flavors, um, this is like a good dessert flavor. Crazy custard, strawberries and cream. You're definitely getting some of that like angel food cake type of taste with it and um, you're also getting some of like it basically tastes like crazy custard mixed with a very very sweet strawberries it leaves a good taste in your mouth and that's one of the biggest things that Hyde um, can really um, that's what sets them apart man um, if you don't know the pineapple ice these are the biggest selling of their flavors from what I know Stores around here cannot keep themselves stocked with pineapple. These are a hot freaking commodity. Um, 
All right, which one do you want to know about next? Blue Raz is more subtle. I'm going to tell you right now. If you think that Blue Raz is going to jump out and like bite you in the tongue, not the case. Blue Raz, um, it kind of tastes like their um, blueberry ice, which tastes like a blue Slurpee from the Slurpee machines, like when you were a kid. Um, but the Blue Raz is slightly different. Tastes like a blue Jolly Rancher. Um, and again, it lingers in your mouth. It tastes like candy. This is something that you could keep around. I got two of them because I figured I wouldn't get sick of it so fast. And um, you could chief on it. Again, you will break a sweat if you puff these too much. If you chief on these, they give you an estimated about 400 hits or so. Um, these are, let's see here, vegetable glycerin, propylene glycol, natural and artificial flavors, nicotine 5% by volume. So, um, I forget how many milliliters is in one of these. It actually doesn't say. Let's check the box. Anyway, doesn't say. Um, let's go right over to the Pink Lemonade. The store that I went to, um, the owner decided to pick one of these new Hyde flavors and buy for himself. And then he let the customers and people come around and get the rest of them. So I was nice enough to let him try each of the flavors that I bought that he hadn't tried. And we both agreed that our favorites were the Crazy Custard, um, the peach mango watermelon and um, yeah the blue raz this right here was his go-to compared to smoke with a Q again great product very smooth um, you would really have to be chiefy chief and on these bad boys to really give yourself that kind of like you know hard to breathe um, uh, throat thing but Pink Lemonade has almost a little bit of like an ice thing going on. Um, you are getting, again, like that pink floral kind of lemony, but pink lemony sugary flavor to it. It leaves like a really sweet flavor on the tip of your tongue. Um, and again, the only ones that I didn't really review here for you, um, some people get tired of the mango. I personally don't. I think it's a solid flavor. Um, I didn't review the pineapple ice because it's almost 100% guaranteed to thrill the shit out of you. And, um, yeah, strawberries and cream as well. This one, um, it's just hard to pick a favorite, man. These things just continue to impress. Um, if you're looking for something that's an alternative to having a big-ass mod, if you're sick of buying jewel pods over and over and over, Again, the hides, once they're done, they're done. Um, you can kind of put them down for a few hours, and then you can hit them again. After they start blinking, you can hit them a few more times if you're like me and you're just trying to get the most of them. Um, but in general, once they're done, they're kind of done, and you unfortunately have to do away with the uh, these, little, these little guys. But um, they're worth going back and purchasing if a smoke shop near you has them. Get on that, playboy, playgirl, and uh, we'll get back with you. From Rochester, New York, have a good end of your summer. Uh, we'll see you back here.